Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So this is a channel update video. Um, I was probably supposed to make this like two days ago, but I was I was away on holiday because of Chinese New Year. This is always the hardest video to make, I think, because one, for one, it's very long, two, um, it's not really related to game stuff. I think it's easier to talk about game stuff because, like, there, game stuff is just straightforward. I, I think that's one of the things um, gamers, like, in general, really like about games. It's just they're straightforward, and things in life aren't really straightforward. You, um, like, a lot of things are just intertwined and stuff, and, um, I have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about, but anyways, uh, <laughs> this is my channel update video, I talk a little bit about what's been going on in my life, as well as what I'm planning to do in the channel. So, um, yeah, I think right now I'm, I'm, I'm in a pretty happy place, like, I, I just, I don't think, I think comfort is, uh, it's definitely something you need, like, once in a while, but then, like, too much of it can, can make you lazy. The, where I'm going with this is, I used to, I used to be a lot more, um, hardworking, I think. Like, I'll, I'll talk about the time when I, like, you know, was, when I first started making content for Monster Super League, I would just push content out non-stop. Um, and then I would try to make it, like, I would, I would try to optimize every video to make sure I, I, um, you know, get ranked higher on YouTube, get put on the recommended list, and then like click clickbait like mad to make sure people click on my videos and stuff, um, compared to whatever other videos on the recommended list. I've been doing a little bit less of that, I think. Although my thumbnails are still really click I don't think my thumbnails are all that clickbaity anymore. Like they used to be super clickbaity, but now they're just pretty normal. Like I just put whatever random anime girl images I like. Like I used to, I used to strategically plan it to, to like, so people would click on them and shit, kind of, something like that, um, but then I, I've been doing a lot less of that now, although some of it is, is still pretty clickbaity. Now compared to, compared to a lot of the old shit, like it's not as clickbaity, it's, it's way less clickbaity than, than anything. Um, Although for the past few days I've been making like custom th thumbnails for every single one of my videos. I think it's definitely a, a really good idea. I do enjoy making those thumbnails. Like I I think of making thumbnails as an art. Um, in both the figurative, figurative sense and the literal sense. Like it's an it's an art in the in the the way that you're like you have to optimize col colors and stuff to make it look visually appealing. Um, and an art in the sense that it's like a an, an art, like a like a a skill basically to make a thumbnail that are that people are more likely to click into. Um, but yeah, I, I I do actually like doing it. Like it's it's actually pretty fun. Um, I don't know. I, I don't. I I've always um, I've always like liked making art, like doing drawing. But then I I've never been trained in that that way probably due to my education because you know education system just makes you learn shit like math and science and history I mean history does have some uses no history is mostly useless fuck history just uh, just write it down on like fucking wikipedia and then I can look it up whenever I need to um, but you know like Math is pretty useful, but like math up to a certain point becomes less useful. I think. I don't know. I just, I just, I'm just rambling. I'm just rambling on about random shit right now. But um, where, where was I going with this? Oh yeah, I, I think I'm in a pretty comfortable place. Like I've, I've basically make like two videos a day. Um, one for Lynch Red Knights, one for Monster Super League. Just doing random things that I do daily. Like the random things that I'm supposed to do daily, um, and yeah, it's it's just pretty pretty normal, just doing doing everything. And I I, I really have a lot of fun playing these games right now. Um, I think my my just 
being able to have fun playing playing the games that you're playing like is, is really really important for a YouTuber that makes like video game related stuff like a gaming YouTuber I think it's really really important um, I think a lot of people like did have done horrible things to their their channels like a lot of big youtubers and I have done so in the past before because I wasn't happy with um, with what I was doing you know basically and I was spoiled also at the same time I think I was a as a youtuber I was very very spoiled um, and at, like after two years after after kind of losing everything I've um, things have things are in the proper perspective right now I think for for me um, <laughs> A little bit of a story time, or just a little bit of a story, uh, just, okay, this is probably going to not be a little bit of a story, it's going to be a pretty long story. Um, originally when I started play making YouTube videos, like, I, I started making YouTube videos and I started streaming kind of at the same time, um, because I, I just wanted to make it as, like, you know, professional, like, you know, do this professionally as, as your job. Um, I think it's like the dream of pretty much every everyone in, in, in my generation um, to to be able to do this to, to be able to do this full time it's like it's basically like trying to trying to live the dream um, and I'm still trying I, I really haven't given up but I, I do know that there are a few things that are needed like it can't it really can't all be fun in games um, because if you really want to do this like it's a lot of hard work as well and I, I understand that but before I didn't like I I was really spoiled um, as a youtuber my my first video, like my first actual video on YouTube, like when I did the summoning videos on Summoner's War, I have, I think right now, I think within um, three, four weeks or so, I've, I've gotten like 20,000 views on that video, like as a first video on YouTube. Can, can you imagine that? Like, um, and I, I was really spoiled because I, I thought that was normal. I thought that was the, the way things are. And then um, before I started making other videos on YouTube, I tried to replicate that success, and it never happened. I think what happened on that video was it, uh, the algorithm, YouTube algorithm, just kicked in, and that video was just shared everywhere, and then um, a bunch of people saw it, and that was why that was why it was it kind of blew up, I think. And um, for a long time, I was trying to replicate that success, and then before, like usually when I make videos, random videos, like after that. I would get like a few thousand views, um, which is like a lot compared to whatever whatever views I'm getting now. But um, but now I'm I'm a lot more humble. I think I just I have I have my uh, perspective like just you know set straight. It's not it's not fucked up anymore because I I know it's not easy. Like you know every single view that you get on YouTube is not it, it, you have to it's basically one person watching it. But, to me, it used to just be, just be a number. Like it was, I thought it, I thought of it was was pretty easy. You just spam it, share it everywhere, and then you have people watch your videos, and that was that was it. Um, it wasn't until I, I quit Summoner's War and I started losing a lot of subscribers that my that my perspective started to change because I before um, while I was doing Summoner's War videos, I, I've always been trying to branch out. I've been trying to like do videos related to other things as well, but it never really worked out because I, um, like because every time I would do something, I would try something else, like play some other game, um, I I would get like you know a few hundred views, and then I would think that wasn't a lot, and 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 yeah, I would stop, you know, and then I would I would always go back. And then it felt like, for a long time, it felt like at the end when I when I quit um, Summoners War, it felt like I I was trapped and I, I couldn't get out because I like I couldn't expand at all ever because I was always stuck there um, doing the same exact thing. And whenever I tried to do something else, when I tr whenever I tried to branch out, um, I wasn't able to. And now I've realized that it doesn't actually matter. Like as long as as long as some, there's some people interested in your content, your your channel is eventually going to grow. Um, but I, at the same time, I think, like right now, I'm in a happy place. I think it's uh, it's it's kind of time to try to expand, try to try to push myself a little bit more. Um, 
One, I do want to make more content in the games that I'm, I'm playing, because I haven't really been working hard at that. At the same time, I also want to try making, like, try try other new games as well, other mobile games at the same time. Um, I think I, I really do like playing these types of games, like monster collecting, auto farming, where you can just leave it here and then you just sit back and you can do whatever you want to do. Because I'm getting old, like, I, I think, I feel like I'm getting old. I feel like I'm not that good, like, mechanically at games anymore. So I usually just play these uh, strategy based games, you know. I'm starting to lose my voice. Anyways, there's there's two things I've been thinking of doing. One is to, obviously, I think that that's the original um, thing I, I wanted to try was to like you know find some game that I I would be interested in playing in the long long term. I I don't feel like playing games and just you know um, trying them out once and then quitting. Obviously, I could do that. I could make a series like that, but I'm not too interested. Like I'm I'm not too um, I, I want to game that I can play for a long time and just, you know, be invested and, 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 uh, you know, just like, like what I'm doing with these games with, with Monster Super League and Lineage, be able to keep playing and, and continue and progress and stuff. Cause I, I do like the feeling of like, you know, being able to do that, but I, I haven't been able to find a game that is, that is, uh, that's good enough. For me to just keep playing, you know. Um, I feel like I've only really stuck with Lineage because I, I started playing like, right when I when I started. If I started later, I probably would have quit when a lot of people were quitting because I would have felt like like because I I'd be a follower. But but for for Lineage right now, I'm like the 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 one leading, you know, because I was I was one of the people that first started playing. Although right now I'm not really all that competitive anymore, I dropped out of top 100. Really can't get back in. I mean, if I'd really tried, I probably could, but then it wasn't. It's not. It's definitely not as easy as before, because a lot of people are basically as as strong as me, and there's no way to really increase my overall team's like power besides spending more money. Um, so I'm kind of just you know chilling here playing and raising whatever monsters I want, you know, experimenting with new things. I, I like doing that in these monster collecting games. I like being able to raise new monsters and try new things. Um, for a long time, I think on Monster Super League, I was, I was bored for a while because I was like kind of fed up with, because I started late, I missed out on all these opportunities that a lot of people had before. But right now, I'm, I'm kind of, uh, I, I, um, ever since I got this Dark July, it's been things have been different because I, I, uh, I was able to do what I wasn't to, wasn't able to do before, and she kind of replaced whatever I, monster I needed um, or missed out on, you know, from from previous events. So I don't know if you guys have any recommendations for games that I can try out or play for the long term. I don't think they even need to be new games. I've been trying to find new games, um, but I think right now I'd, I'd even settle for for some games that are are kind of niche that people don't really play that much, but still still play. And the game is like good, so it has you know has stayed alive for a long time. Um, the second thing is. Uh, there was some talk on my Discord channel with a few people, like viewers of mine that were originally from when I when I played Summoner's War. Uh, you know, they keep wanting me to go back and play Summoner's War. I I think I probably would have went back if they allowed me to play on emulators, but it was so like I, I'm so spoiled now. I, I I can't handle having to hold my phone and, and play games. Like it's, it's so hard to record Summoner's War. Like I had to hook it on, onto my computer, um, and then you know, run the screen sharing thing, and then run up OBS and record from that because I wasn't able to record, I wasn't able to run the game on an emulator. Um, but I think it's not too bad. Like it's, it's definitely still doable 
but I like if I do, I probably won't be playing as much because I can't play it on an emulator. Um, yeah, they they wanted me to go back and just you know, if you guys remember, uh, there was a series that I had for Monster Super League, but I kind of stopped. It was called Extreme Free to Play Pleb. Um, they wanted me to do something very very similar to to that for Summoner's War, where I can't make any use any Nat four Nat five monster. Only farmable monsters, you know, something, something along, along the lines of that. Um, I'm not too sure, because, like, ever since I quit Summoner's War, whenever I go back, I would, um, I would start up the game, I would update it, and then I would start playing. I would go and I would farm, and then I'd be like, no, I can't do this. Like, I just, I've been through this, like, you know, a million times. No more. Um, but I, 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 I don't know. I, I could, I could still give it a try if you guys are really, um, really into that. If you guys would, would want that. But yeah, that's that's pretty much it. That's that's all I've been really doing. Um, so um, until I find something else to do, or if I really decide to, to 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 go back, crawl back, and start sucking sucking dick again. Um, I'll be doing what I do daily, and if you guys have any recommendations for games I can play or try out, um, definitely, definitely tell me because I'll, I'll, I'm, I'm willing to try anything right now. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Um, I'm gonna keep keep doing what I what I do every single day, and thank you guys again, um, everyone that have supported me. Um, you know, just, just by watching my videos, that is like the biggest support that you can get from this. You watch every single video that I upload. Um, I'm really bad with promises. Like I always, I always say I'm gonna do something, but then I don't do it. I I like quit have halfway. Um, but yeah, I I I do want to start making more content again. I always say that, but then I don't. I mean, besides besides uh like spotlight videos. I mean, I've I've been trying to do similar content for both games, like where I, like review monsters, um, do spotlight videos, but I can't do spotlight videos for Monster Super League unless people share their their monster with me, like email me and tell me I they want to do a spotlight video for for whatever monster. I can't really do that unless they, people do that, and I could keep doing those review videos, but um, I guess they're okay. I just need to make more videos, like, I think people will watch them. <laughs> you guys will definitely watch them. Just need to start working hard again. Yeah, that's 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 actually pretty comforting to know. And also stop getting so addicted to League. Like, I, I've been playing so much League of Legends, I, I have no idea why. Um, <laughs> I... Like, I, I would make League content, but there's so much... So many people already making League content, and I can't really compete with them. So... Whatever, and I'm not really good at league. I'm I'm pretty pretty scrubby. So it's kind of whatever. But anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, thank you guys so much for, for all the support. Um, thank you guys to the people that have stuck with me for a long time, and as well as the people who have recently joined and started uh, helping me grow this channel again. I'll definitely be keeping up with what I'm doing right now. Um, and whatever new things I do will be added on top of what I'm doing right now. So, yeah, no, don't worry about me, um, you know, stopping whatever content you like watching. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.